Hello viewers, this is the Ontario Robotics team called the Nasasio Daniel from 6 Science 1. What's the Christmas? Well, today we'll bring you an exciting project of the Ontario Gripper. Imagine a world without technology, but Ontario has it all. This is called the Ontario Gripper, so basically what it can do. Well, first of all, before I go any further, let's see how we made it, because we, we get every particle. These are particles, it's, it's just a single particle. We move every particle, every particle, and we make this whole thing. We come up with this whole thing because of the Ontario robotics team. Because so what can it basically do? Well, we realize that in, in some factories or even in our school, people have to pick things, have to take them somewhere. So what we did is, if at all you want something like that, this is the robot that can do everything that we need. You can, you can use it for gripping, it can grip. And goes back to where, where you have programmed it to be. Well, it's operated in very many ways. First of all, there is programming where you find if I say you program this robot, it can do something without even your control. Just leave it, it does everything that you want. And actually, this infrared sensor that works in a range of 100 to 125 millimeters inches, you can you can program it such that if there is an ob an obstacle or if, or if at all it senses someone approaching or, or any object according to the millimeters or inches that you have set it in will stop and after someone has moved it will continue and drop something and, and it will again go back to where it has been. What else can it do? How, how else can it be operated? Well as the entire robotics team we decided to make an application, an Android application. It's actually even on Google Play. You can download it. It's called the Ontario Robotics. Simple. So we decided to control this robot but right now it can only control the motors. Yeah only the motors and even the gripper. The middle motor and all the motors in A and B. So what it can do is, it can actually move forward, it can move forward, after you can even use it for moving backwards, then when you're approaching an object and you want to get it, if you want to grip it, this is the thing, it can grip it and hold it tight, it can also release it and goes back to where you have set it to be, we can give them a life. Well, this is what I'm talking about. It can move forward. But all you want it to grip, to grip something. Then after, it can also release it. And it can actually go back. It can turn in any angle, 360, any angle. Move forward, grip, move forward. Anything that you want, it can do it very well. Well, this is the first clip as entire robotics team. And, uh, yeah, wait for more. Stay tuned because more is coming. We have very many things in store. Just stay updated.